Hi, this is Heidi from ABM International, and I'm going to show you um, how selecting the four points in your multi-point boundary tool makes a difference. So let's first make a couple boundaries with multi-point. I'm going to make a little bit of an odd shape so it's easy to show you what the difference is. And I'll say done. Now in this first one, I'm going to select the four corners of my boundary, starting with the bottom left. I'll say OK. And I'm going to choose this one, this one, this one, and this one. Now when I place my pattern, you'll see that the pattern, or the computer, chooses these four points of the bounding box to go to those four points that you selected. You see these points of the pattern that's placed are in those points of the corners you chose. So that kind of squishes the pattern a little bit. Now if I wanted this pattern to fit better, I would do something more like this. say done. And now the four corners, I'm going to evenly space. So if I wanted to start with this one, I can. But I'm going to skip one and place one over there. Skip one and skip one. Now they're evenly placed. So when I place this pattern, it just has a more pleasing effect. It hasn't gotten squished. So choosing where those corners of the pattern um, are going to be generated is important to how your pattern ends up looking.